Hey there everyone, welcome back to Game Find and my name is David. Today we are reviewing Pickles to Penguins. I bet you can't make a connection between those two. Alright, so as a disclaimer, this is a review copy from Outset Games. Thank you so very much for your support. Really do appreciate it. Now, this is a party game that has a ton of cards with different pictures, and what you're trying to do is to connect two pictures and uh, use a complete sentence to connect them to the point where everybody agrees at the table that the two cards are connected and you got to do that 25 times to get rid of all the cards in your hand to win the game but it's a party game so you just play to your heart's content now i am I'm okay with party games they hit or miss with me um, and there's not much to really go in with this I just told you how to play so let me show you what comes in this box which is a lot of cards and uh, then I'll tell you how to play let's go all right so what's in the box is just a ton of cards and you pick up a lot of them they're very light they kind of feel like cork board a bit uh, but they're thin uh, they couldn't really settle on what type of art they wanted. They wanted uh, realistic art, or do they want cartoonist art? They just didn't make up their mind, so they just put a little bit of everything in here. So again, this is just a game of a ton of cards. Now you've seen them, now let me show you how to play with them. Now this game is really simple. Everybody starts out with 25 cards. The name of the game is to get rid of your cards and be the first person to do that. Uh, how you're getting rid of your cards is um, you're trying to create links that are viable between two objects. So pickles to penguins, how do you connect those? If you can justifiably connect those by using a complete sentence, um, and everybody agrees on that, then you can uh, discard the card next to it. So basically, I'm trying to connect the cards from my hand, and I can say sheriff badge to stars, they look the same, and that is pretty obvious. But then I can say, well, this dog has like a star shape on his forehead, but then if somebody challenges me, everybody will have to talk at the table and kind of see if that's something that is a link and if they say yes then we continue playing if not then i get penalized and get five cards now everyone is going at the same time same time and trying to be the fastest person to do that now if somebody uh, wanted to challenge me but then another person played a card on top of the card that wanted to be challenged well they missed their opportunity and now i got away with that but that wouldn't be good for this i think uh because uh both of these are a means of transportation, that's good. Uh, dolphin, because both of these are in the water, that's good. But beetle, uh, just because uh, a beetle sometimes flies on a boat, I don't think that's a good connection. Again, that's all you're doing, trying to be the first person to do that. And if everybody gets stumped and they can't do anything with the two pictures that are in uh, the middle, you just flip two more and continue to play until somebody gets rid of all 25 of their cards. You can play multiple rounds if you want. You can play alternate game styles that they have here that I'm not gonna go over, but that is the basics of this game. Now, let me talk about my opinion. All right, so that is how you play Pickles to Penguins. And let's go ahead and give this game a grade. It gets a 55 for me. Uh, this is not something that I am really into. The first play was fun. The idea of connecting things together um, with all these cards, okay. But it seemed like a grade school activity to me and I got really bored really fast. Um, my partner seemed to enjoy it because it's like uh, a stimulating kind of brain thing, logical things, so she she dug it more than I did, but overall I'm just, I can't recommend this one. Um, and there's not much else to say other than that. The production's okay. Um, actually, it's a little below okay. Uh, it's, I'm not a fan of this, but if you are into party games and you are into this, you already know if you like this. So I'll leave it in the description below. And uh, warning, you already know what this game has. And it's not something that I can really push. But, you know, it will satisfy an itch for a group out there. So if you like this game, that's awesome. I'm glad that you do. And thank you so very much, Outside Games, for providing us with all these games to review. I really do enjoy reviewing board games for you, and uh, I can't wait to review your next one. And thank you so much, Vine Nation, for clicking like and subscribe. My name is Dave. Until next time, I'll see you. Have a great rest of your day. Great time to play. Bye. Bye.
Vine Nation, we love making content here for you on the channel, and we're almost at 10,000 subscribers, so subscribe now and help us out. This video right here, I think you'll like. This video right here, YouTube thinks you'll like. Or you can just sit here and watch me dance as a dinosaur for a little bit longer. You can visit us at our social media outlets, and we're going to be improving our Patreon here soon. That's all for today. Miko, it's time to go. Good girl, Miko.